everyone, this is Sherry S. Loves Tarts, and I'm here with a new to me vendor. And the vendor's name is Hope, and the company name is Happy Hippie Scents. And on the 12th of January, I was watching Stacy Kippy Cat's video on Happy Hippie Scents, and she did a nice review of the tarts and things that she got to review. And she also said that there was a sale going on. So I went to the website. I went to her, I think I went to her Art Fire website. And she had her hippie squares or her two ounce square cents. And they were 99 cents. That is a great price. Regularly, they are priced $1.50, which is still a good price. So. I put in a small order, just wanted to try her out. Um, I like to give new vendors a, a chance. And I have to say I'm very pleased. The customer service was so good. There was a problem on the website. Uh, one of the scent shots charged too much shipping. So it always takes the highest shipping and then zeroes out the rest of them. So for some reason one of them had a higher shipping price than she had on that she was uh, stating so all I did was leave her a note and she got back to me within and it was less than an hour and she asked me if she if I wanted a refund or did I want to just add another set shot and of course he asked a wax addict do you want some more money back or do you want more wax I said more wax so <laughs> I got an extra set shot so let me just show you, she sent an invoice, which I love when someone sends an invoice. I'm not going to show you the top because it has my information, not that my camera focuses or anything, but at the bottom she put a little smiley face and hugs and kisses. And thank you, Sherry Hugs Hope. So this did not take long to get to me. I have to say her turnaround time is awesome. And I had to actually make notes to tell you the sense because <clears throat> it's, I guess she has a theme going. That's why I put this colorful um, background down because her theme is hippie times. So all of her set shots have 70s, I guess hippies, 70s, I guess 70s. Um, so I had to look up a lot of the set descriptions. Um, this is what they look like. They're very large. To me, they seem more than two ounces. But this first one is Love Child. I know you can't read that. <laughs> and Love Child is Orange Cupcake. I'm going to take this first one out just so you can see. How big they are I think they're pretty large and it's one of my favorite scents orange I am finding I love creamy orange scents like creamsicle scents that kind of thing and I think I'm gonna have to go back and get some more of these <laughs> because I love this scent and you know, my son got me, for Christmas, he got me an uh, orange dreamsicle from Keystone Candles near my house, and I love that candle. So this would be so nice to mount my warmer while that candle is burning. Let's see. The next one I got is Hip Dip, and that one is like a creamy orangey color. This one is a gray color, and I ripped the bag. That's so my fault. I was in such a rush. And the scent description for Hip Dip is Blackberry Fizz and Vanilla Extract. And it's strong. It's, I actually do get the fizz note. It like tingles your nose. And the vanilla, I'm not getting a whole lot of vanilla, but I get a lot of the Blackberry Fizz. So that is very good. The next is 
berry lavender lemon and this is a nice pink color and I really like this one and I'm, I don't really like too many florals but I think the berry is toning down the lavender lemon the lavender lemon is pretty strong but the berry just mellows it out so that is very nice I have a feeling I'm going to be making another order okay this one is 1971 and the scent description for this one is blackberry cheesecake and zucchini bread I love zucchini bread oh her zucchini bread is really good it's not too spicy oh it's good and the blackberry cheesecake just makes it creamy so okay. this is hippie cream this is the one I asked her to add to my order and this is black currant and vanilla got a lot of berry scents Oh, this is really good. Um, this one is really strong on the blackberry. Really strong on the blackberry. I'm not getting a whole lot of vanilla, but I assume that if the vanilla wasn't there, this would be even stronger blackberry. So, I mean black currant. So, very nice. This one is Happy Hippie Tea. And this, I was very unsure of this one because honestly, when I got it, I didn't look up any scent descriptions. And I said, you know, when I was smelling it, it didn't smell like tea to me. And it still doesn't smell like tea to me. It's the uh, scent description is sweet mango, passion fruit, tea. I really don't get that. Uh... It's almost to me a florally scent it's I, I'll have to melt it to see if it smells more like the mango in the passion fruit okay this one is I lava you and this I was really looking forward to because it has all the scent some of the scents I really like it has sugar cookies pound cake buttercream and sugar pie crust <laughs> it's a lot of sweet oh, it is so good this is another one I'll probably have to repurchase because everybody knows I love like um, Better Homes and Gardens their, their frosted buttercream cupcake and this is what it reminds me of except this is a little deeper and I think it's the sugar pie crust that gives another note to it. So I like that one. Okay, this is, I love the name of this one. Don't worry, be happy. If you're of an age, you'll remember when this was so popular. That song. Oh, it was everywhere. And this one is Peppermint Bark and Toasted Marshmallow. It's really good. The peppermint bark, you really get a chocolate note on it. Ooh, yeah. And the mint. So that's a very nice scent. So far, I've liked every scent. <laughs> okay, this one is trippy. I couldn't find a scent description for this one on the website. So I'm going to sniff it. <laughs> See if I can figure what it, out what it is. I'm not good at that, so. Well. I have no idea. Fruity? It has a fruit scent to it, I think. I don't know if Hope watches these videos, but if somebody else has gotten trippy, if you could put down below what's in it. I like it, though. So. I can't wait to start melting these. 
Okay, I got two of the next scent. And that is Rain and Rainbows. Um, and this one is supposed to smell like sherbet ice cream. It didn't say which sherbet ice cream it smells like though. I'm assuming the tricolor one. I really like this. I love sherbet smells, so like that. And I think I have one more. And this is Loopy. And this is Fruit Loop Scents and Zucchini Mixed. So. I get both. The, loop, the Fruit Loop Scent and her Zucchini Scent. Oh, so good. I wish she had just like a plain Zucchini because I am liking her Zucchini Scent. It's very good. And she sent me two samples, which is so nice. And this first sample is Headbands and Hippie Tails. These names, <laughs> they just crack me up. And this one is Lavender and Peach. And it's, I really don't get a whole lot of peach from it. I'm getting the lavender though. Well, no, I just popped it out, so. I am smelling some peach on the bottom. So that's really good. And this other one is Postcard from Paris. And this is an unusual combination. I love it when a vendor does unusual combinations. This is clean cotton, coconut, and sweet candy. So, first when I saw the clean cotton, I was like, oh, it's fresh. I don't really like fresh too much, but this is really good. It, I, I get mostly clean cotton. I'm not smelling too much coconut. It's, it sort of, to me, smells like a sweet cotton scent. So that's my order from Happy Hippie Scents. Um, she has a we the website that I went to right now. She has the Hippie Scents which are these squares and they are $1.50 and right now she's selling them custom so you would order and she would make them up fresh for you and she also has on the website on that website um, the eight ounce scoopable bowls and for eight ounces of scent it's eight dollars so that's a dollar an ounce that's a good price so check her out if you get a chance. Um, I'm not saying bye from her because I haven't melted any of these yet. So I'm going to let them cure a little more and then they'll, I'll start using them. And you'll see them in my wax recaps. Thanks guys. Have a good night. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.